Well, good morning, everybody. I decided I'd go to town and pay my garbage bill. It came in the mail. I've been talking to my daughter, and I told her that I, it seems like all I do is come into town or whatever and pay a bill or whatever. And I told her, since she's, I don't know, accountant, CPA, a financial analyst or whatever, I said, ain't there a way to set up me a separate account uh, to pay my bills that I would get a statement that they're paid before the next month or something similar to that or, what, or make a phone call and, and, and make sure that they're, it's took it out of my account or whatever. Uh, that's, she says, Dad, you just worry too much about a bill. And I've always, I'm leaving the yard, I've always made sure my bills are paid. She said, yeah, you pay them like 30 days in advance. I mean, if, if you get them the last week of one month and they're not due to the next month, the end of the month, or the last day of the month, you want to pay them before the next month even comes due or whatever. But anyway, and that reminds me, I need to go pay my internet bill, whatever. Uh, so, uh, but I was thinking if she could set up me a separate account, I don't, you know, whatever. I want it, uh, I want it where I know it's paid, but I don't want to mess with, you know, paying it or something, or something like that. And she said, well, Dad, I told you I could take over everything. Well, there's some things I don't want took over. I want to make sure that if I go on a trip or whatever, I am come back, because she has a tendency to put things off the last minute. She's a procrastinator when it comes to her personal business. And how the kid can't even... She does that manage multi-million dollar, but then she has to work on her own damn checkbook. I, I don't like that part. To me, I like something already pre-done or whatever. And that's what I'm working on. Look at that Jeep, white Jeep, call it a lawnmower. Horse trailer, this is the busy intersection. Have to be careful. Uh, I don't get in no hurry. They go, Boy, I'm telling you, it's all lawnmower season. It must be the last mow of the season. Everybody got their mowers out. There's a blinker there, and blinker there, blinker there. All right, he said he's going to turn. He said he wasn't, so I'm going this way. Uh, gas is $2.99 for diesel. Unleaded. I don't know what unleaded. $2.69. It's cheaper for me to drive this damn ambulance than it is to drive my damn pickup. My son's borrowed it anyway. But no, I've been working on a few things I want to talk to people about. Now, what's this? Big oil drum coming down the road. Oh, they had a fire in Oklahoma City with some og and &E gas lines on fire. And here comes a big oil drum down the road. They're going to move over. Oh, that's one of the gas plant. But anyway, I want something similar to my life ain't tied up with paying a damn bill. I can be out camping and I know when the bills get mailed and so I rush back to pay them, you know. My daughter says, well dad, you've just done that all your life. And I said, uh, well I said I really didn't. I said, your mother took over. She done all that stuff and I never had to worry about it. And now that I have to worry about stuff, I guess I don't have to, but I should or whatever. But I do anyway. But anyway, I want to talk to you guys about something. I'm really thinking about restructuring my channel. And I'm thinking about either maybe setting up another channel. A friend of mine was talking. He said, you like to do art, you like to do crafts, whatever. And he said, you need to set up another channel and really get into it and do some editing. I don't edit. I really don't. I think people that edit, this is my opinion on it, and I never did even tell him about it. My opinion about people that edit, they're trying to hide something. If they say a bad word, oh, I'm going to cut that out. Oh, if they say something uh, insulting or derogatory or whatever, oh, I want to cut that out. I don't want to hurt any of my uh, so-called uh, uh, Patreons or whatever the hell they got, whatever they got going. Uh, me, I'm just who I am and I don't care. Of course, now, I need to probably edit bouncing roads out, this, that, and the other, or structure it better, where it makes it more presentable, or whatever. I've been a little bit lazy with this channel. I've had it forever. That's why I said I've been a little bit lazy. But I'm thinking about really getting into the arts and the crafts. 
and I mean he might even set me at the Etsy store. I guess that's what they call it, and a PayPal. Hell, I might even put up a Patreon, get all the thumbs down. I, I just want to do something. It's either that or I'm going to make an application to my Walmart over here because they're always wanting me to say, hold, uh, Mr. Slauson, you need to fill out our application so you be one of our door greeters. Well, I, if I do that, if we can pick your own hours, your own days, and whatever. Boy, you just want to run this stop sign. Don't hit my ambulance. It's precious. What's this sign over here saying? I'm going to read backwards. I don't know. It says turn that way for something I can't see. Or you can't read upside down. But anyway, um, that's what I'm thinking about doing. I'm thinking about putting up, changing the channel, or just making a new one. He says just make a new one. That's what makes good sense. But then I have to get a new fan base, which, you know, I think in, uh, I thought about naming it the Bookmaster or something, you know, what that catches, you know, I'm not a master by any means, but something that catches people's attention, you know. Um, and just leave this one for just general talking, basically. Or venting or whatever you want to call it. But if whatever you guys think, whatever, let me know. Uh, let me know just exactly uh, what you think about that. You know, I've got to make some changes in my life. I told somebody I was 86, but hell, I'm 87 because of August. That's uh, where I was born August. Uh, so, one thing I don't like about this damn man is it ain't got cruise control. How the hell can you make you put it on cruise control and go get in the back make a cup of coffee? <laughs> like, the, like, that, like that joke was. He set it on cruise control, went back and started playing cards. What the hell is he way over? Hell, I guess he thought I was in an emergency room. This ambulance, everybody moves over. He moved over. I ain't got a light on that I know of. No, I ain't got no lights on. An emergency siren or anything, but everybody just moves over. I sort of like it. I started about painting it. Taking redoing the stuff, but I said, Nah, I think I'll just leave it like this. It's like my school bus. I can drive down the road and stop to make a turn right or left, and everybody stops behind me. They won't pass, even though there's no lights on, no nothing. And it doesn't say school bus. I mean, it, it, nothing. It's just a yellow school bus. And in Oklahoma, you can leave it yellow and everything else, but you cannot use the lights or uh, the emergency stuff. And like I told one cop, he said, I said, I left it on the ambulance and the bus. In case of emergency, I can turn on the sirens, lights, or whatever. If I'm having a heart attack or something and I'm parked in the middle of the road, somebody might walk up there and say, you need the ambulance yourself. <laughs> well, let me know what you think about me doing another channel or doing re that on this channel, changing the name, and putting up a Patreon, a GoFundMe, I'm, I'm thinking, I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, but uh, not really them two, but put up a PayPal and an Etsy store. Them two I really think about doing. My friend says it don't hurt to put up a Patreon. Well, I don't know where I'd want that or not. I don't want to go fund me. I, I just want something different. You, you, you people that's got a YouTube channel, you know what I'm talking about. I mean, it, you want something different. You want to strike out i see people, oh my goodness, on Facebook they change their profile picture and stuff like that. I think I'm getting where I want to just change something in my life. You know, change it where it's basically, uh, it's more beneficial to me. I'm thinking about making my crafts, my books, inlay. Uh, I'll even do some, show you some other arts and crafts that you can do. And, uh, Basically something like that, uh, but I want to. I'm going to get a bunch of it so it piled up. And if I don't, uh, I mean, I've got enough friends. I'm giving stuff away. And he says just put up an Etsy store or in a PayPal. You need them to definitely. And I, and he said you should go ahead and put up a Patreon for whatever. I said I don't know about that. And I don't need no GoFundMe. I mean, I'm 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 all right financially. I just I want to do something, you know what I'm saying? I've worked all my life, and 
now I want to just do something. You know, deep. my daughter says, write your memoirs. I said, well, psh, all that. Uh, but I'll, I'll figure out something, trust me. I want you guys to help me. What I should do and what I shouldn't do. And a lot of my friends have been with me since the beginning, and I really put you guys as, and all of it, uh, opinions to heart. I mean, I really do. So what should I do? Should I make another channel, or change this channel, or and put up an Etsy store because of my crafts, and a uh, Patreon, or and a uh, PayPal? You know, and uh, a friend of mine says, well, how-to videos. And he said, I said, well, hell, I'm going to be dead in about five, ten years, maybe. He said, well, your grandkids and your great-grandkids could maybe work financially off of it or whatever, get some benefit out of it or whatever. And I thought, well, that's true. And I, I could show them that, uh, how to do things. But anyway, let me know. I really appreciate it. Let me let you go, and I will talk to you guys later. Like I said, I ain't even got a thousand subscribers. Uh, so I, can, I don't even monetize. And that's another thing. He said you need to monetize as soon as you can. It's good advice, it's sound advice, but I want my opinion of my people that actually watch me, their opinion of me. You know, and I really want your opinion. I mean, I'm not, I mean, you know, I'm gonna take a, a, a census or a poll and find out what is people really want out there. And let me know, please, I appreciate it. You guys take care, have that great day.